Well, hello friends, beautiful rising, good afternoon, and or lovely evening to you, wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is our daily chakra energy reading, and today is Monday. August 29th of 2022, so the last Monday of August before we head into September, so by the end of this week we'll be in a whole new month, like a whole new energy, kind of like officially starting that like fall vibes, let's see what else, it's Labor Day weekend, so yeah, there's a lot of good stuff going on for us all this week so uh and as a little historical uh well i don't know if it's like an historical fact or anything but today was the legendary michael jackson's birth day this is the day that he originally touched down onto earth and began to grace us all with his presence and talents. So, yeah, happy birthday to the legend. So, all of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whenever you have found this video is when you are meant to hear the message. So, if your guides have led you here, your spirit, your ancestors, your higher self, the divine, MJ, <laughs> MJ from the other end, from the other side, no, I'm just kidding, um, or if someone has shared this video with you and you decided to watch it, then there is something here for you, so... Let's give the cards some shuffles and see... What energy comes through for us today for this magical, marvelous Monday? One more shuffle. All right. Okay, got some good shuffles in today. Oops. I gotta put those together. Okay, let's see which one, are, oh, there we go, we had a card fly. Let's see what we have today. Today we have the third eye chakra, Ajna, card number 74, 74 adds up to 11, so you may see some 11s today, you may see 111, you may see 1111, however it works for you. But 11s are master numbers and they have to do with like spiritual insight, new beginnings because ones are the beginnings and so, you know, new beginnings and things, however you feel it applies to you within your own journey, you will know. So, this chakra is located in the space between the eyebrows. This chakra is closely associated with the pituitary gland, eyes, ears, nose, nervous system, and the brain. So I feel that our third eye chakra is coming through today just to give us guidance as far as when we are using our third eye, what, what physical parts are we using? So when we have, so when we're using our intuition, not only are we using our, obviously we're using our brain, but we're also using our nervous system in the way that we are seeing how we feel, how we feel like within our bodies. We are, when we're using our eyes, we are not using our, only our physical eyes. We are using our inner eye to see, and with the ears, it's us listening for the right things and making the connections. 
and with our nose, we could be smelling things that, you know, trigger our intuition. So with this, I feel that it's just giving us a whole, like a well-rounded way to look into our intuition because it's not just, you know, like foresight. It's, Maybe you can hear something that triggers your intuition. Maybe you see something and what you see triggers your intuition in a different way. What you, you know, what you smell, what you hear, what you feel, all of this has to do with our third eye chakra and our intuition, our seeing things from a higher point of view, the bigger picture, however you want to look at it, however this card resonates for you, you will know. But the the chakra is located, like as it says, in the space between the eyebrows. So if you ever feel pressure there, or if you're ever feeling like like a tingling there, I sometimes will feel tinglings there. Um, it's usually your third eye chakra. If you feel like it's anything more than that, then of course go and see your doctor or whatever. But most of the time when our body is speaking to us, it's speaking to us for a reason. And it's not always about being in pain or anything like that. It's if we listen to our body, we will realize that Every single interaction that we have on this planet with whoever it is, is there for a reason. It's there to make us feel a certain way. It's there to trigger us in a certain way, whether it's for a positive or what you would observe as a negative reason. Everything is there for a reason, and it's up to us individually to use our discernment to know what we are meant to learn from, grow from, etc. So today we're being guided to be mindful of our third eye chakra, being the being mindful of the way that the things that we see, the the things that we hear, um, you know, the things that we smell, etc. And of course, the way that we feel within our own nervous system. So. Yeah, that is the message for this marvelous Monday. I hope that you all resonated with this message. And if you did, then please feel free to like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below if you so choose. So thank you once again for stopping by the channel. I will see you in the next one.